Animals are great. Living through times like we are right now, I'm super thankful for animals. They're innocent, they keep it real, and I feel like we have a lot to learn from them. There are some animals that we know and love, but there are plenty we might have never seen before. In today's video, we're talking about 10 unique animals you won't believe actually exist. Don't forget to smash the like button, subscribe to The Supreme, and click the notification bell for more lit content. Let's get rolling. Echidna Puggle Okay, I think we found the cutest animal of all time. I can't believe I didn't know they existed. Meet an Echidna Puggle. A puggle is the name for a baby echidna, by the way. And how cute is that? Echidnas are egg-laying mammals native to Australia and New Guinea. They are often known as spiny anteaters because they have similar eating habits. Also, shout out to anteaters, another weird looking animal. I guess echidnas are kinda weird crosses between anteaters, hedgehogs, and platypuses. Echidnas evolved between 20 to 50 million years ago. Can you believe that? That snout you see there is used as a mouth and a nose, and they have great claws for digging. I love these creatures. It seems that when they are under threat, instead of trying to attack, they just curl into a ball. They are lovers, not fighters. They also can only reach maximum speeds of 1.4 miles per hour. If you are a new fan of these strange animals, you might want to get yourself an Australian 5 cent coin, as they appear there on the back. Awesome! Has anyone watching seen Fantastic Beasts and where to find them? This looks like Nifflers. I'm convinced they're the same creature. I better hide all my valuables. Glaucus Atlanticus What is this? This looks like a cross between a dragon and a Pokemon. Although when you get a sense of how big it is actually, it's kinda tiny. This bizarre creature is less than one and a half inches long. The creature actually is a sea slug that can be found floating in waters off South Africa, Mozambique, and Australia. The Glaucus is unique not only because it looks like an alien, but because it has a pretty crazy way of eating and warding off predators. These creatures are able to eat larger, venomous killers such as the Portuguese man-o-war jellyfish. They then use the venom from their prey and store it for themselves so they can use it against their own predators. They basically steal poison and use it for themselves. Blue Parrotfish Seeing a blue parrotfish is a reminder that nature is awesome. A bright blue animal, how cool is that? These amazing creatures can be found in the southwestern Atlantic and in the Caribbean. Not only are they among the most naturally vibrant animals on earth, they also look like happy little guys. Sometimes they almost look as if they're smiling. Something that I have in common with blue parrotfish, they spend 80% of their time searching for food. Blue parrotfish do have pretty big teeth, so I wouldn't want to get in their way even though they look friendly and pretty chill. These unique fish also serve to clean coral reefs, which stops them being smothered by algae. Good job, parrotfish! Emperor Tamarin Okay, I've got some serious mustache envy right here. Look at how awesome the facial hair on this little dude is. He just looks so wise. I feel like I want to go visit an Emperor Tamarin so they can give me some life advice. These critters are from the New World monkey family and live in the Amazon basin. Apparently, they get their name because they bear a passing resemblance to the old German king, Kaiser Wilhelm II. There's some trivia right there for you. The monkeys are fast and playful in the wild and in captivity they are known to love human company. That being said, if you anger an Emperor Tamron, they will likely show you their impressive array of teeth. The animals tend to hang out in groups and take part in mutual grooming. I hope they have beard oil and a good comb for these mustaches. Just for a little bonus, do you want to see what golden lion tamarins look like? Well, here you go. Breviceps gibbosus Meet the screaming frog with a face like thunder. Okay, you've seen it, now you have to hear it. This little amphibian clearly has some thoughts. 
These little critters are found in South Africa and they usually burrow underground in damp areas. They surface just before rainstorms and are often called Cape Rain Frogs because of their love of a wet day. The frogs don't look like regular frogs. They're very round and fat looking with grumpy little faces. I'm kinda into their angry squeaking. Wanna hear what they have to say one more time? Yeah, I feel you, dude. Puss Moth Caterpillar Say hello to one of the most toxic caterpillars in North America and Europe. The creature is as toxic as it is ridiculous looking. They are green and fat with distinctive red and yellow faces, making them look like caricatures. They grow to around 3.1 inches and if you see one, you should never touch it. If you do, you could be in for a world of pain. The creature is covered in little poisonous hairs that, if they come in contact with skin, will cause intense burning and a throbbing rash. Some people experience swelling, nausea, and even stomach pains. Another fun fact about this weird-looking caterpillar, if it feels threatened, it will strike a defensive pose and squirt acid. Angora Rabbit I have never seen anything so fluffy in my life. How can this be real? Angora rabbits are living, breathing fluff balls. They are undeniably some of the cutest animals on earth. If I'm ever feeling down, I just need to remember that Angora rabbits exist out there in the world. These rabbits are domestic rabbits that have been selectively bred for their long fur, basically by breeding fluffy rabbits for generations. This is what we've created. The rabbits were popular pets for French royalty in the mid-18th century, which makes sense. Giant Angoras are the biggest of the Angora breeds and weighs up to 12 pounds. The rabbits are often used for their fur and they are massive shredders. In the 2016 edition of the Guinness Book of World Records, Francesca, a two-year-old English Angora rabbit, was named as the fluffiest rabbit in the world. With 14.37 inch long hair. Hairy frogfish. From a hairy rabbit to a hairy frog, or a fish, I'm not quite sure, but it sure is weird looking. This is one of the strangest things I've ever seen. At first, I thought it was a clump of seaweed, but then I realized that it's an animal. This master of disguise lives in subtropical areas of the Indian, Pacific, and Atlantic Oceans. They mimic coral around them in order to catch prey. Check it out. So swift, they bite faster than we can blink. Their mouths are vacuums that can suck up prey in one six thousandth of a second. The fish blend in well with their living environments, and they basically just live to eat. I hear that. Anyone else think that hairy frogfish look like sea monsters? Because I certainly do. <laughs> banana slug. What is this thing? The banana slug is a bizarre looking creature. It's so yellow. Not only are they bright colored, banana slugs are one of the largest species of slug in the world at 10 inches long. Oh, and they have a tongue covered in teeth. It's estimated that they have over 27,000 teeth. Other fun facts about the banana slug, they only have one lung and they insulate themselves with protective mucus. Lovely. These slugs live in North America and have a lifespan of around seven years. Bat-Eared Fox Today's video has really taught me how many awesome animals are out there. Look at that bat-eared fox. Seriously big ears. This animal looks photoshopped, but it is very, very real. These foxes have been around for about 800,000 years and live in the African savanna. Those big ears you see are over 5.1 inches long, making up nearly one-fourth of their whole, whole bodies. These big ears allow them to hear insects digging around. Sure, they're good for hearing, but they're also used for body temperature control. These foxes are super social and hunt in packs. They're playful, but they can be aggressive. Like with any wild animal, they may look cute, but it's better to keep your distance. That was 10 unique animals you won't believe actually exist. Which was your favorite animal on the list? Have you ever seen any of these critters in real life with your own eyes? I'd love to come across a few of those, but there are some I would like to stay away from. 
Let us know your thoughts in the comments.